Hello everybody, welcome back to, I guess, Dino Bro Reviews on Dinosaur Toys, or in this, I guess in this case, Sea Reptile Toys. Uh, Jurassic World Dino Rivals, just welcome back to Jurassic World Dino Rivals, and, uh, I've been waiting for this one for too long. I want to just get to it. I saw the Plesiosaur, and that original one, I never got my hands on. This is the second one. I have to f see if that first one's online anywhere. Because I heard that a few people got it, but that was it. It was like really small scale, like nobody got it anywhere. And I don't know why that is. It just doesn't, it just seems like sometimes some of these Jurassic World, or just Jurassic World toys in general from Mattel are just, for some reason, so much. They're just, so many times they're just rare. Nobody can get their hands on them. And I can't, for the life of me, figure out why that would be. Come on, pull out. Of the box. Oh, geez, that neck is really in there. I was really happy to see a second, you know, sea creature beyond, um, beyond the Mosasaurus because I was kind of hoping that maybe, maybe hope that we might be able to find one day a, uh, a Dunkleosteus toy from Jurassic World. Not with Dino Rivals line, obviously, or not with the uh, Primal Attack line, not with the Dino Rivals line. In fact, I don't think the Primal Attack line has any sea creatures. I'll have to go double check that. It'd be disappointing if it was. See that in the box. I'm reviewing this alone because all the ones that are in the box are already ones that I have reviewed. I don't even know if I've uploaded them or not because I just realized I have an Amargosaurus that I haven't uploaded the review for at all yet. It leaves me with three reviews to upload. Yeah, let's take a look at that artwork. Oh, that's beautiful artwork. Look at that Plesiosaurus. Pretty weak stats. Makes sense. That Plesiosaurus wasn't really a beefcake. Maybe, uh, those flippers flapping around. So we have, like, reverse motions. And that's really responsive. Really good. And you can even set, the you know, like, you can do the Nessie pose. So that the neck has a good degree of motion in it. Up, going up, though, it's, like, a little bit squeaky. Going down, it's just fine. I don't know what that's, I don't know what's up with that. This neck, though. Yeah, we got, we got good range of motion on this one. Excellent on this one on this joint. This joint's fantastic. This joint, I don't know. Going up seems like it's a little bit weird. See the mouth? It's really easy to night. It's really easy to open and close. Really responsive, and they have a posable tail. I mean, it's pointless, but I prefer pointless uh, joints over no joints. Get the little I image in there, and yeah, I mean the colors I think are just like like this is tan instead of white. Based on the like the original one, it's pretty much the exact same, and I have a feeling they did that because they were making that first one, and then they saw the deal wasn't going to work out, and they made a second one of nearly identical status, just so that everyone could have a plesiosaur. This is gonna be very short because it's really just a really cool sea creature. It's tiny though. Uh, where's my? I'm gonna grab one of my Baryonyx here, the new one from Dino Rivals to make it thematic. If we set him up, you can see just how small he is. This is. An absolutely tiny plesiosaur. I thought they were like a lot bigger than this. I mean, look at this is a baryonyx. A baryonyx is not very big. Like it's, I don't know, it's bigger here in the toy than it is even in real life. But I felt like a, like a, like a plesiosaur would be at least like if I just hold it up by perspective. I thought it'd be at least this big. Like if just based on like if it, if like these were like the same size based on you know the perspective I'm holding them at. But instead. Just, I mean, just look at how small he is. Looks like a baby. He could just be scooped up right out of the water by the Baryonyx. Just chomped on. I guess he'd have to be pretty far out in the water to catch a plesiosaur, but hey. Point still stands. Yeah, we got this really, really small. He's going to look so small compared to the Mosasaurus. I feel like the undersized the plesiosaur and the oversized the Mosasaur. But nonetheless, I like the toy. I like having a second sea creature. We've gotten 100 pterosaurs. We've gotten... Of course, we've got tons of dinosaurs, but we've got basically no sea creatures. No, no, none of these aquatic reptiles. And it's really sad to see that the only thing we got in that for the for the primal attack line is going to be the uh, Sarcosuchus, and which looks awesome. But you know, I'd really like give us a Megalodon, a, a, you know, Dunkleosteus, and a Lasmosaurus, uh, Hybotus, anything, Unchoparistus, or however you pronounce it, I think that the Spinosaurus ate, like. Just give it some more sea reptiles. Come on, guys. You, you, you're doing great everywhere else, but you're giving us a hundred of the same pterosaurs, and we've got 
three sea creatures, two of which are the same. So yeah, awesome toy, really small. Get your hands on it if you can. I forgot, I didn't even talk about it, whether, yeah, never mind. I should have mentioned, I always, I, it's been so long since I've done the reviews, I've forgotten how to do them. I usually talk about whether you should buy them or not, but I've only just done this. I didn't do that with the Margosaurus. I didn't do that with the Spinosaurus or the Primal Tech Dracorex. Which I think all of them you should buy, except for the Dracorex. That's kind of just if you want it. But yeah, I'd, I'd say, if you have, you should definitely pick this one up. It's only like, what, 10, 15 bucks? You know, it's, 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 this is the Savage Strike line, right? Yeah. I think it's gone on long enough. I've talked about a toy with very minimal talking points for as long as it can go. Actually, those teeth look pretty good. Practically no bleed over. And the eyes are fantastic, too. Great paint job. But yeah, so that's it. I'm going to go ahead and upload this. I'm not going to drag this on to 10 minutes. Just, just for YouTube.